read the press releases. Uh, I guess I should give a little intro. Um, uh, everybody, it's the Reverend, and I'm here with Ken Pooch Van Druten. Actually, I'm not here with him. I'm in uh, Las Vegas, and he's in Dallas. I am, and, yes. And we are on Skype talking. Uh, you just got back from a uh, another tour leg with uh, Lincoln Park. Correct. In yes. Asia, yes? Yeah, we went through all through Asia. It was really, it was a, it was a great little run. It's uh, one of my favorite places to tour is Asia, so it was good. Okay, and um, for at least some of those gigs, you were using a new PA, yes? Uh, yeah, well, uh, one in particular. Uh, we did a, a gig in uh, Indonesia, in Jakarta, uh, where there's a promoter there that is uh, buying a, a bunch of new uh, PA boxes, and so um, Adamson um, basically sent over uh, their new PA for him to try out and to to check it out. And also for me, you know, I, I had been involved a little bit with Adamson uh, and got to see some of their new PA uh, prior uh, to to this gig, but had never, you know, heard more than five or six boxes together. Right. Uh, and this was a, a huge, it was a huge gig. It was a, it was a soccer stadiums and it was 60 boxes of this. Oh. Um, so it was it was a little bit of me putting my ass on the line, you know, saying to to uh, to Lincoln Park management that hey, you know, we're we're going to use a brand new PA that's really not tried and tested. Yet. <laughs> that's a, that's a fun conversation to have. <laughs> the rigging of this box is really incredible, um, and, and so from a system engineer standpoint, uh, I think that's the number one seller about this box in comparison to other boxes that are out there. It's really really fast and really. Um, really intuitive and really cool how they built all of that. So, so that alone, just for the rigging aspect of it, and for system engineers, and for you know size and all of those kind of things, it's it's kind of the next generation in that sense. Um, you know, because every production manager is always talking about how they want uh, their their uh, sound guys to get their shit out of the way, get it up in the air, get it out of the way. You know. Um, and, uh, and, and so, you know, this is, that's a selling point to, to definitely to production managers. It's, it's, you know, they can rig, uh, you know, uh, 20 boxes aside in about half the time of what I've seen other line arrays go up in. So, of course, you know, that to me as a, as an engineer has a back burner to the fact that this box really sounds amazing. Um, it's a, a two 15 inch, um, you know, woofers and, and they are using, uh, the same technology that no one else is using, which is, uh, Kevlar lines, uh, you know, uh, subwoofers, uh, or woofers and subwoofers. And so all of their, um, you know, all of their speakers are, are made with Kevlar and they're made in house. Um, and it, it makes, um, kind of a, a stiffness that happens to the, to the cone, um, that is different from paper, and and so it provides kind of a, a punchier uh, tone, a bit more musical, I think. Um, and so when you're comparing this this 15 inch box to other 15 inch boxes, the fact that the speakers alone are Kevlar um, as opposed to paper makes a big difference. Um, it, it, you get this low low mid punch. Uh, that that just can't doesn't happen in in some of the other uh, line arrays I've listened to. Oh, man, this box gets so friggin' loud. Um, I mean, loud enough to where I'm just like, Jesus, dude, that is ridiculous. Like, fired it up and immediately out of the box, it was like you know 112 dBA weighted in front of house. Oh my I god! Like, I you know I I I listened to I, I think like you know 10 seconds of it and said okay. So now I'll take the master all and turn it down to minus ten. That is fucking. Uh, so if you're looking for loud, uh, this box gets it. Um, but what I what I also found was that um, when you do, when you turn it down, it's a very it's it's got a lot of finesse to it. It really sounds great. It's just a um, it's a really great sounding box. I really really like it. I, I am super pleased. Um, that they were able to, to me, it, it beats the Y18, which you know how much I like the Y18. Yeah, yeah, it's saying something. Um, yeah, so um, for them to come out with a new thing and have it be definitely better uh, than their old stuff. Now, I'm not saying their old stuff is bad. I still love the Y18. I think it's a great box. 
Uh, but I think that this is kind of like, you know, uh, version 2.0, you know? Right. So if we had to sum it up in three things, what I'm hearing is um, my grandmother could rig it. Yes. Um, uh, that it's loud as hell if that's what you want, but that it's also very musical. Indeed. Yeah, I think that's that's perfect. You know, you're, you're always very good at summing up my uh, rants that go on from... <laughs> <laughs> Love your rants, Pooch.